When I was young, I didn't believe in getting cars out the dealer, bro. I would always get them for $1,000, man. One of the sponsors right here on Whittier and Atlantic, right in the hood, G, you know what I'm saying? So right now, I'm out here with my son. He about to come out right now in the video. And uh, I'm looking for cam for a fucking cars because this motherfucker about to be in high school, you know what I'm saying? So I got to look for some get that full cash money, you know what I'm saying? Because you know how it is when you get your first car, you're going to crash a couple times, you know what I'm saying? Hey, G, what up, G? So we over here, man, and... You know, so I, I was just telling them and thinking about, man, what the one thing that was fucked up, G, is when we be over here buying cars for $1,000, right? And you know we ain't got a license, G. So we get that shit taken, right? Then they get the 30-day hold, G. It has a 30-day hold, G. Then they want to tell you, hey, bro, uh, don't even worry about it. You just got to pay $2,700 to get your car back, G. You got the money? Cash credit or debit? Like, motherfucker, can I give you EBT, G? And that's between here and like two years, G, because like, what the fuck, I only paid a thousand dollars for that thing, G, and the other worst part, G, hey, take notes, G, another part, G, is like, when you, when, when you buy the car and two days later, something wrong with it, G, you take that shit to the motherfucking mechanic, you know what I'm saying, the mechanic, like, okay, there's about 17 fucked up things here, right, but, uh, the one thing that's, uh, not allowing your car to start, G, that's gonna cost you about, uh, I see your, your shoes pretty dusty and all the shit pretty fucked up that you're wearing. So I'm going to charge you for the low, 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 G. It's going to be about uh, $2,200. you are like, what the hell, G? I only paid $1,000 for this thing, G. So, hey, man, but I remember them days, man. It's pretty fucked up, man. But I'm just got to be ready for that shit. So, hey, man, if your kids don't know about that shit, make sure you make them aware of that shit, man. Black and brown, we out here in the east side. You know what I'm saying, man? Just out here chilling, G.